I've been thinking about this all my life as a surgeon, really, frankly, but breast cancer lumpectomy surgery is way less precise than it really could be and the way that a lot of other surgeries are. How could we do breast cancer surgery more precisely and decrease the chance of having cancer at the edge of the specimen when we take it out? Imaging is in the prone position, so a woman is on her stomach and her breast uh, falls away from her chest wall and there are a lot of reasons for doing that and then in surgery she's on her back so the breast changes shape so the change in the shape it can be very extreme and that registration process is, is challenging and maybe not even possible. I needed a better guidance system. Here's an example of a breast cancer locator. Um, it's custom made and designed for each individual patient. So these um, allow a surgeon to place a needle through the middle of the port, a specified distance into the breast, and then the needle is removed and a wire is placed through the needle and is left in the breast. And this is really easy for the surgeon to do. It takes about five minutes while the patient's asleep so she doesn't have any discomfort at all while this is being done. So now, if a patient has you know, a tumor that's deeper in the breast, um, it, we have these wires that guide us as we're doing the surgery. The breast cancer locator originated from research that was done here at Dartmouth-Hitchcock Medical Center in New Hampshire. Other companies have innovated and done some very exciting things. Wires have been replaced by seeds. There are tissue inspection solutions that, that find cancerous tissue. These are good innovations that help surgeons. But what they are lacking is that total solution of localization and surgical guidance in a very comprehensive way. The patient's position in the operating room, adding a 3D visualizer on a computer screen of the tumor and the breast so that the surgeon can plan for and actually execute surgery. And then having all of that with the wires and the bracketing and the central of the tumor Having all of that in one solution gives the surgeon the confidence that he or she needs, but also gives the patient the kind of clinical outcomes that she needs that hasn't been delivered before. So in totality, BCL provides the most comprehensive set of guidance cues a surgeon can get that's easy to use in the OR. It's individualized for every patient. So there is no guesswork in terms of adapting the device to different patients, different breast sizes, whatnot. It's just made for a patient. It allows easy transfer of cues. It simplifies the workflow uh, from, a, from a guidance perspective. Now we've got a device that shows you where the cancer is in the breast. It shows you the shape of the cancer. It's just what you wanted, okay? And it's just what I wanted, is to have that 3D picture of the cancer in the breast. We've also built a team of really high quality experts from industry and from academia that bring all the skills. It's not about logistics. It's not about replacing wires with seeds or with inspection probes. It's about improving the clinical outcome of the first surgery, doing it right the first time.